guy right here. All right guys, we made it to White Rock Dodge and it's pouring rain, but I just saw the truck pull in that has all the motors. They just came across the border from the States. It's right here. This thing is packed full of V8, guys. So let's get on with today's unboxing. Christmas in November, pouring rain. It couldn't be any worse weather for doing this, but uh, you know, here we are. Typical BC, right? Oh, if you guys saw I want a Corvette, look. <laughs> S small misstep with the logistics. We don't have a we don't have a forklift here at White Rock Dodge. <laughs> I got a tow strap. We could just <laughs> just drive it off with the Jeep. Oh, careful. <laughs> Axle set number two. All right. We've uh, enlisted the help of a forklift to get the, uh, the actual motors off and the other axle because it was getting a little too, a little too sketchy. We gotta be careful. We don't wanna break it before we get it on the Jeep, right? Look at what we got right here. AMW big box. That's a big box. It's a, it's a mystery box. We don't know what to motor. This is definitely gonna be the most epic unboxing ever on the channel. Look at the size of this freight coming off of here. Holy moly. Is that a Hellcat on the side? Oh, this one's got a Hellcat too. Oh, okay, well that's, that, that doesn't mean anything. This looks cool. <laughs> Which is which here? Which is, which There's some little which? holes in the side. There's grab handles oh. if you want to just pick it up, you know. And okay, so we've got to sort this out we before do. we uh, go over to Epic. And look at these. <laughs> look at this stuff, guys. This is insane. Who's excited? Who's excited to see this well, in the Demonator? Uh, yeah, Rich uh, is. Uh, Rich, <laughs> Rich is probably more excited than anybody here. <laughs> well, we have a, a two and three chance of bringing a demon over. <laughs> we do. What, what do you What do you think? <laughs> you think this idea will work? Okay, so we have to figure out which ones have the demons, and uh, which one is not a demon. I think we found the labels. <laughs> They're under the black plastic. <laughs> What does it say? What does that say? It says White Rock Dodge Demon. Demon. And what does this one say? What's yeah, this yeah. one? And Demon. Demon. Hey. hey! I got too excited. Wanted to make things happen. <laughs> Sorry, guys. So, Casey, that one's yours. Right? Woo! There you go. I don't even have that. That's not even a demon. Kind of what I was thinking, right? <laughs> I mean, it's cool that they put the logo on there, but how. Yeah, anyways. There it is. The Demonator's heart is in its box right behind us. So we're going to get this loaded into a minivan. You got a minivan? Minivan, yes, two of them. <laughs> two minivans. So one will drive backwards and one will drive forwards. <laughs> We've got another transport coming to grab this. We're going to fire it in here in one hour. And then we're going to go over to Epic and start this unboxing. I'm gonna show you guys everything that comes in one of these kits. I'm excited. Are you guys excited? Let me know. There she goes. Loading up the demon. Off to Epic. The ginger is patiently, or uh, probably impatiently waiting for this to arrive and unpack it and get going on the uh, install. But we're gonna show you guys everything that's in here in just a minute. And there it goes into the truck. Bye demon. We'll see ya. We'll see ya. Let's get in the uh, let's get in the eco diesel. Get dried off. Get warmed up. Go over to the nice warm shop over at Epic, and uh, say goodbye to our good friends here at White Rock Dodge. Remember, Rich is putting his phone number, his direct line. Direct line. In there the you go. I'm warning you I now, man. It. Honestly, I happy to do it. Everybody, I it, right? Happy to do it. Give me a call. Any questions? Love to help. So there you go, Rich Hamlin, White Rock Dodge. You want a swapped Gladiator Wrangler? You want a stock Gladiator Wrangler? You want, why do you have Mustangs here? Come see the guys over at White Rock Dodge. They'll give you a hand. And even, look at this. If you actually want an actual demon, a real demon, a stock demon. Oh, I wish we could take this for a test drive, but it's just way too wet. So I need this logo. What do you guys think? We gotta get one of these logos on the Demonator. That's slick, but we're putting that motor, 840 horsepower <laughs> into a Gladiator, guys. Gonna be on the vlog. What are you doing? You're jumping to the shot. Gretchen's here. <laughs> Got the uh, Snazzleberry color match smart cap with the glass. Look at this thing. Oh. Woo. That is great. That looks good. That looks good. 
And uh, Gretchen is one of our Patreon members. If you want to go check it out, I'll put a link to our Patreon down in the description below. You ready to see the demon unboxing? Oh man, I am absolutely sticking around for this. This is going to be exciting. <laughs> All right, guys, we are back in the rain. We're back at Epic Adventure Outfitters, and our demon is in that truck right there, arriving right now. Warm up the Toyota, Ginger. Look at you put a little seat cover on it so it stays dry. That's, that's cool. Oh, uh, you know, Toyotas are known for leaking. I don't think we could say that as Jeep <laughs> owners. <laughs> oh, is that even ours? That's a pallet of something else. My life. <laughs> <laughs> that's not ours. On the topic of more power, we've got the new EcoFlow River 2 behind us here. Go check this out. This is a nice, compact, and affordable portable power system. It's got a 256 watt hour battery in it and a 300 watt inverter that boosts up to 600 watts. They are available now. Go check it out. Link in the description and there's a coupon code for you guys if you want to save a few bucks. It's here! It's here! <laughs> the engine is here! Everybody, be excited! <laughs> sooner it's here, sooner Casey leaves! <laughs> Unboxing time! Woo! Uncrating. Nobody says uncrating. Oh, that's what we just started. <laughs> you're, you're not doing a serious unboxing if it's not a crate. Yeah. <laughs> Look at how silent this thing is. We're gonna build the opposite of that. The complete opposite. Did you dry the seat like off this time? Gone. So first to come off is our transfer case. Rubicon transfer case. Wow, that's the biggest engine I've Look ever at seen. that! <laughs> the hybrid! That thing's gonna move! We actually ordered the one tenth scale motor. <laughs> the one twenty four scale. Yeah, they Oh! <laughs> this is their new demon RC car. The real challenge is getting it. Getting it off the thing. Casey, look at all the problems <laughs> you're causing here. This is all your this fault. Is not, I hope this you is know. not the first. This is not, this is not the first time we caused problems here at Epic. Here we go. Here we go. The logistics. Ta da! <laughs> Safety second, right? No, you're good. Well, at least it's not going to fall too far. <laughs> look at me, Casey. This is now the most powerful Toyota in the world. <laughs> we just made a 840 horsepower Toyota. All right, the moment we've been waiting for, the box, the box is here. What do we got? What do we got? What do we got? So what do we got? Today we're going to uncrate. That's right, I said uncrate, not like unboxing like all the other channels trend. do. Yeah. We're setting the bar a little higher. And I don't know if you've noticed, but up here in Canada, gas prices have come back down. So what better way to help that even more is to put an even bigger <laughs> engine in a Gladiator. Yeah, forget fuel economy. <laughs> forget fuel economy. What engine do you say? You just have to wait and see. Oh no, we know. We know. This is a demon. Box number one. Oh, so it's an unboxing and uncrating. We got, what, exhaust parts and everything on top? This is like the supporting cast. <laughs> this is the main show. Woo! <laughs> That's heavy. Let's see what we got inside. What's in box number one? A lot. Imagine. It's so big you can't even cut the whole tape off that at once. Is, uh... This is what happens when you go a little crazy on Amazon. Woo! Oh, you know that. I'm amazed Prime delivered this so quick. The UPS driver hates us. Yeah. Here, let me Fancy set the box parts. down. Some sort of metal thing. Oh, that's good. It's glad you can figure that out. <laughs> Ooh. Yeah, that cardboard. Look at the tough. size of that. So we looks like we got a radiator, exhaust pipes. So we look like we have more parts than last time. A massive, so, massive exhaust. So who's got a tape measure? We need to. Yes. Wow, oh, that is a really nice square piece of aluminum. Very nicely welded. Here, this is a coolant reservoir that's gonna go where the spare tire was. Three and a half inch on this side. Okay, so this here's is the, the final tank. Hang, hang on, we're gonna measure the tip. 
Is that the only part that matters? Three and a half inch exhaust. <laughs> All right, what is that? This, this is a coolant tank. For the supercharger? For the intercooler and the supercharger. <laughs> cool. This is gonna be a bit of a project. <laughs> At least oh. we got till Christmas. <laughs> you got lots of time. I'm going to Disneyland. <laughs> Holy moly. That's interesting. It's the bracket for the thing we just found. Yeah, it is the bracket to hold up. Pretty sure to hold the coolant tank between the frame rails. This is probably the oil cooler, fuel line, coolant tube, all custom pieces. So is there no no muffler? <laughs> what do you think, Gretchen? Ah, <laughs> uh, yeah. You know, it's uh. <laughs> I, I got, I got no words. Just this nothing, is a, it just leaves you speechless. Yeah, That's this is much. nuts. It is a spectacle. This is the craziest, this is the craziest Jeep project ever. Ginger is sorting out engine brackets because we have to, if you watch the rest of the build series from, we actually cut all the motor mounts off from the factory 3.6 liter. And we've got new motor mounts from AMW that uh, the crew at Epic is gonna be installing to hold this 840 horsepower monster in place. Ooh, exhaust blanket. So this is gonna wrap around the catalytic converters, uh, each one. Yeah. Because the whole idea is to get heat out, keep heat away from areas it doesn't want to be. The important bits and bobs. Yeah, that kind of thing. <laughs> Fire is frowned upon. These are the cap, by the way, these tiny things. Oh, perfect. We don't need those. Oh, here's the muffler right here. Nice and, nice, nice and compact. This is the resonator. It looks like they've made a new cross member. That explains why that, I think that bracket. Ah. Uh, this is new that I've, something they've added since I was there. So they've been updating the Demon kit as we go to improve it. And this is like the newest, newest updates to it that with some improved a, parts. Improved that's a beautiful. Look, look at that. That is a hell of a <laughs> beefed up OEM looking cross member. That wow. is monstrous. And it looks like that will probably probably be lower on the one side and it's gonna go to this bracket likely. We might not have to do a secondary fuel pump. Oh, you think they've upgraded the fuel pump now? Well, their goal was to do a drop-in fuel pump that would yeah. provide enough fuel. Yeah. And this, well, one, it's a Mopar part. Yeah. So they may have made it work. This is just your- Radiator. Um, says oil cooler, rad fan, cap, and plug. Oh, it's a, Woo, look at that. What do we got? Oh, nice. Ooh. Ooh. Look at that. So we got a little bit of an upgraded cooling system going in. That's pretty fancy. Yeah, the craftsmanship on all of this is second to none. In. Yeah, it's, it's, you know, so if, you know, the big thing with the AMW kits and that's why White Rock Dodge and Epic are going this route for swaps, is that everything they do is is like to an OEM level. It's the welds are all like probably better than OEM from the welding perspective, but all the wiring, all the plug-in harnesses, everything is just like it should be from the factory if you could order a Demon. Thermal. Is it a supercharger? Yes. <laughs> what is that? It probably could be the coolant pump for, for the whole the system. This is a very plug and play kit, right? Like oh, yeah, weekend yeah, weekend. DIY. We, uh, yeah. yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> just bang it out in a long weekend. This is just ridiculous. I can't even like explain to you guys how insane this whole thing is. It's gonna be so much fun. We haven't even opened what the crate yet. Yeah, we, we haven't we, even we, opened the awesome box. Yeah, I know. This is, this is just like the muffler. <laughs> <laughs> how loud is this gonna be? It's gonna sound loud, but respectable. Look at all the bits. Look at all the harness. Look at that. We got new tranny cooler lines. We've got heat shields. There's the engine mounts. There's what you're looking for. That's what I need. One engine mount. We've got exhaust. More wrap. It's not a wrap. It's uh, actually you slide this. Yeah, it's all for that hose. It's gonna go back for the coolant. Look at this. And there's oh, the there's one with the their one. logo in it. They even put their logos on it. Look at that. Cool. So all in all, we've got all the parts here. We've got the new, that's the cool bottle. We'll have a washer fluid bottle here. We'll have a colder intake here. We've got the new giant throttle body. Holy thing. Yeah. Rad hoses, AC lines. Look at this. Quick connect for coolant. An elbow. Where do have elbows? Oh. 
There's our Z Automotive Taser. Taser. In this box we have wiring, air filter, probably oil cooler lines by the look of it because we do add an auxiliary cooler at the air oil filter. Look at the welds on there, laser cut with their logo. This thing weighs, <laughs> weighs a ton. All right, the moment we've all been waiting for. What's in the box? Great. Great. <laughs> Ready? We ordered the wrong one. <laughs> Get off my engine, Ginger. What are you doing? <laughs> wow, look at that. The red valve covers. Oh, everything. everything. No. Ooh, look at that. No. Look at this. Oh boy. Well, we got to, you know, nothing like pull. Look at that. <laughs> hey, look. It's an engine. <laughs> Look at that! Holy crap! Guys, <laughs> this is insane. Absolutely insane. Look at that, they built a deck! Yeah, like, D Dust Dustin would be proud of this deck. <laughs> Holy crap. Peeling back rip this back? What yeah, the? man. We gotta see the demon. <laughs> Jeez. Wow. Holy crap. What have you done? <laughs> I don't know. Um, I don't know. This is the journey that we've gone down, guys. This is uh it's pretty crazy. Pretty pretty epic. Next video we're gonna be dropping this into the demonator and getting it mounted up, wired and plumbed. Hit subscribe, don't miss that. Turn on your notifications, leave a like. And if you have any questions about this build or anything you wanna know, leave it down in the comments below. I'll see you guys in the next video. Keep going, Mike, keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. Keep going. <laughs>